And now for today's Bible question. Today we have been learning about confessing Jesus as the Son of God, correctly understanding God's Word and the value of a soul. Someone might ask the question, how can I be sure I understand the Bible correctly? Because the Bible comes from God and reveals to us many things that are difficult to understand, we cannot expect to know everything perfectly. God understands the limitations of our minds and the difficulties we have in learning language, especially when language changes over time. Therefore God has given to us the Holy Spirit to teach us. The Spirit of God can reveal to us a correct understanding of the Bible. You might ask, well, if that is the case, how come all Christians don't agree about what the Bible teaches? The fact is that many Christians do not rely upon the Holy Spirit and speak out of pride or their own exalted opinion. So often Christians trust in their pastor or spiritual leader to interpret the Bible for them, but that can be a dangerous thing to do if the pastor is not careful or not relying on the Holy Spirit. The things you hear on this radio program you should check for yourself and verify that it is indeed the true teaching of the Word of God. Of course, it is also necessary to be a careful student of the Bible ourselves. As we read the Bible, we should learn how to study the Bible using Bible dictionaries, commentaries, and other good reference materials that will aid us in understanding the words and ideas as translated from the original languages. It is hard work to study the Bible, but if our souls are worth more than the whole world, it is worth our time and effort to learn the Bible correctly to ensure our souls are guided by God's truth and not just human opinion. The Bible is a big book and can be complex at times, but God has designed it for the simplest of minds as well as for the most scholarly minds. We can all learn the basic truths of the gospel if we are willing. One thing that prevents people from learning the Bible is pride, since God resists the proud. Also, many are lazy when it comes to reading and studying the Bible, and therefore can make mistakes because they have not been careful to learn well. God does not reward spiritual understanding to those who are not serious about it. Although we may wrestle with some more difficult ideas in the Bible, in general, the Bible is quite available to all who are willing to put personal time into reading, thinking, studying, and relying upon the help and teaching of the Holy Spirit. However, when He, the Spirit of Truth, has come, He will guide you into all truth. John chapter 16 verse 13.